Hi, I'm Rail with Platinum Samples, and um, I'm a Grammy nominated recording engineer. Um, I worked for Oceanway Recording for 10 years, and uh, George Massenberg, Greg Ladani for two, and at Record One for two years as well. We create expansion packs for F Expansion, BFD 1 and 2, and uh, the upcoming three. When recording drums for BFT3, we hire a great studio, great engineer, great drummer, and most importantly, great drums and a great drum tech. And we have them tune the drums impeccably. And we get really well-tracked drums, so they compressed and EQ'd, you just have to load them up, and you maybe some minor EQ or changes just to fit your particular track, but these will sound great right away. We've um, hired Andrew Sheps, who's engineered Chili Peppers, uh, Metallica, and works a lot with Rick Rubin. So, can't get better than that. We chose Ocean because it has a great Neve and a great tracking run. Also has a great selection of outboard gear. Ocean has one of the best mic selection in the world and we brought a bunch of mics in with us as well as using the studio mics and we're also using a bunch of the great outboard gear that they have like Fairchild's and Pultex. Hello, my name's John Emmerich. I'm here at Rockville's uh, Omega Studios in Rockville, Maryland, working on drums for the BFD-3 platform. I'm known for a very acoustic, very natural drum sound. I brought in one drum set, but it's uh, Maple Works, which is a boutique local company in Maryland, and it's six toms, six cymbals, three snare drums and a bass drum. It's being used with sticks, with brushes, and with mallets. I'm Greg, I'm the Studio and Operations Manager here at Ocean Studios, um, and I uh, have a good time doing what I do. The big centerpiece of Ocean Studios has to be our custom 80 series new console. It is one of the baddest uh, consoles out there, and while a lot of consoles seem to be getting sicker and sicker out there in, in studio land, ours seems to get healthier and healthier. Um, I have uh, one of the top techs in the business um, constantly going through it, maintaining it, making sure that that, uh, that our board is up to snuff. I would say some of the other show pieces around here obviously are Fairchilds. Uh, we have the 660 monos and the 670 uh, compressors that not only are very expensive but very hard to find, very, very uh, esteemed historically uh, as, as amazing analog compressors and um, you know, they get used quite often. My name is Evan Johns. Uh, I've been playing for a very long time. I'm 29 and I've been playing uh, since I was a little kid, you know. In uh, recording a uh, sample library, it all comes down to the way the drums sound. And we are relying heavily on Mike Visano and his expertise. He knows exactly what we want and how and how to steer us in the right direction. No, this is what this is how you get a good drum sound, and that's what it's about, you know. Then you set up the mics and and with uh, uh, Andrew Shep, it's it's then it's an engineering thing. But for me as a drummer, it's all it's all right there. It's all right there with the drums. <laughs> 